I watched Making a Murderer with my family over winter break when I was a 2L. Until then, I had no idea that the Bloom Legal Clinic was involved in Brendan Dassey's case. But there were these Northwestern lawyers, professors, and students fighting for justice for Brendan, and I knew that I wanted to work in the Center on Wrongful Convictions of Youth as a 3L. I thought Brendan's case would be resolved by the time I made it there, but a year later, I was completely immersed in it, writing, editing, researching, scouring Westlaw for cases to support the district court's finding that Brendan's confession was involuntary, and eventually representing the state of Wisconsin in the oral argument moots against Professor Nareider. And then on the morning of November 17th, the Seventh Circuit granted the state an emergency stay. We'd lost. Brendan was supposed to go home. Now he'd stay in prison indefinitely. We were crushed. It didn't make legal sense, and it definitely didn't make common sense. It was unlike anything I'd previously felt in law school. Because Brendan isn't a letter grade, he's a person. And I really felt the weight of responsibility to an actual client for the first time. Professor Nareider had to call Brendan and break the news. It was heartbreaking. But she told us how proud she was of our work and that Brennan is lucky to have a team like us. She reminded us that it's far from over and that Brennan needs us now more than ever. That's all it took. We got back to work. As a student, these are the sort of real life experiences you dream of having. Walking into a packed courthouse to deliver oral arguments with a team doing real important work. Taking your seat at the table with professors who are exactly who you want to be when you become a lawyer. It's the best way to learn the law. I'm so proud to have been a part of the fight for justice for Brendan, and now we wait. This work has made me aware of the enormous issues in our criminal justice system, issues that I could easily see myself dedicating my life's work to, and I'm grateful to the clinic for that.